Well, let's shift the focus over to some of the changes coming for officers. I'm enlisted, but I'm sure some of our officers are interested in understanding that some of the changes you mentioned about promotions are going to be pretty big for their career and giving them flexibility to not have that very cookie cutter career path that leads to selection for the next uh, grade and having more flexibility and allowing the Navy to keep its best and brightest officers in that way. Well, what we're trying to do is just not have that golden career path where you check the box, check the box, check the box, and if you miss a box, you're done. Um, it's to make it far more flexible to make sure that we, we do keep the people with the skill sets, the leadership abilities that we want, and that it's not, okay, if you don't do A and then B and then C, you're done. And part of it is things like career and admission. Part of it is beginning to get rid of uh, zones so that it's not when, <clears throat> how long you've been in the service, it's how well you've done your job. And we can promote not based on year group so much as merit.